Your internet friend, Jersey Joe here. And recently I was stuck on a really long flight and kind of bored. And as I looked around the plane, I noticed several black triangles on both sides of the inside of the fuselage. So I wondered, what are these little triangles and airline secret code for? It's not the first time I've noticed these in flight and I was surprised to find that every airplane has them, but they're kind of out of the way so you really don't notice them, but the crew certainly does. Now, according to a British airspace engineer I googled, they are for the crew to find the best position on the inside of the aircraft to quickly see and check the wings. All they have to do is walk up to a row, open a window shade where they can clearly see the flaps and struts and also check for ice and wintry conditions. Now the seats under the triangles are sometimes referred to as the William Shatner seat. That's taken from his performance in a legendary episode of the classic Twilight Zone TV series where he sees a monster on the wing and no one believes him. But hey, us passengers, we can all take advantage of this little hidden perk now that you know about it. If you want to get the best position inside the plane to get that perfect Instagram selfie, or you just want to stare out at the wings, well, hey, look for those little triangles because those are the seats you absolutely want to sit in. Of course, that's easier said than done, though, on airlines that already give you assigned seats. And now for a bonus, why does at least one flight attendant always have their hands behind their back when you board? Well, just like a bouncer in a club, they have a little counter to make sure that the right number of people are getting on the plane. And they also make sure it matches the number of tickets scanned. Now the last flight I was on was accidentally overbooked by two people the airline mistakenly assigned standby tickets to. That delayed takeoff because, well, they had to argue with the passengers, then they had to reopen the door, reconnect the jet bridge, and then pretty much get these people off. And that was a nice 45 minute delay that nobody was happy with. But now you can be happy about that bonus fact and also share your airline expertise as to why you know the secret code behind those triangles on the inside of a plane. Well, I hope it's certainly since some federal seeker or anything is going to get me sued or arrested or anything. It's on the Google machine, though. You can go ahead and verify it if you want. But it's just the fun we have right here in the big YouTube channel. So if you haven't already, click that like, subscribe button. And now you have all kinds of travel shows, fun facts, game shows, and more waiting for you right here each and every week. All right, well, I hope your next flight is much more pleasant than my last one was. Just Joe and your friend here saying thanks for watching, safe travels, and I'll see you next time I hope.